We had a beautiful day in Lafayette. We reached a high of 73 degrees and we saw plenty of sunshine for your afternoon. We're still seeing clear skies in Lafayette and we have dropped to 55 degrees since then. The winds are calm also at this hour with temperatures in the upper 50s and just around the middle 60s. 61 in Rossville, 66 down in Crawfordsville and 66 degrees currently in Fowler at this hour. Isolated rain showers are possible tonight. Maybe even a few rumbles of thunder, but we do have another chance for showers and thunderstorms for your Mother's Day forecast, especially by the evening. And then after a cold front moves through in the middle of the week, we're expecting a cool down in temperatures with highs only in the lower 60s. The system is off to our west. That'll trigger the rain showers. We're still staying dry for now, but more clouds will build in overnight. We'll turn mostly cloudy. Our future cast shows us seeing a chance for showers and thunderstorms popping up around 4 o'clock in the morning and lasting until the early morning hours for your Sunday. This shows 7 o'clock on Sunday morning. Overnight lows will fall into the lower 50s, lower to mid 50s, 59 in Crawfordsville. Overnight low of 52 degrees in Monticello and 51 degrees up in Winnemac. So temperatures will be in the lower 60s tomorrow morning. Still seeing a possibility for a stray shower. We should dry up closer to the lunch hour, 74 degrees by then and then climbing to 80 degrees by 4 o'clock in the afternoon, seeing that chance for widespread scattered showers and thunderstorms storms with highs climbing up into the 80s, 81 in Delphi, 82 Monticello, 80 for a high in Logansport and 82 degrees up in Rochester. There's a slight risk for severe weather just off to our west. The good news is the showers and thunderstorms are more likely to be severe out there. Closer to home, we could see an isolated chance for maybe something severe, strong to severe thunderstorms later in the evening. Our future cast shows most of the rain moving in closer to 7 o'clock at night. We have that line move through. By the time we get to midnight, most of the rain should be moved out, but we do have another chance for showers and thunderstorms for your Monday. But at least temperatures are going to be much warmer with a high of 84 degrees in Lafayette and Monticello, 84 Remington, and a high of 83 degrees for Fowler. That'll be the warmest day of the week because after that we have a cold front that'll push through the viewing area, dropping to a high of 73 degrees on Tuesday and into the 60s. By Wednesday, high of 64 degrees Wednesday. The coolest day of the week looks like next Friday with a high of 61 degrees. Our average high is supposed to be 71, so we are 10 degrees below the average high for this time of the year. But tonight will fall to 53 degrees, turning mostly cloudy with a chance for an isolated shower or thunderstorm. Winds will be coming in from the southeast between 5 to 10 miles per hour. And tomorrow, high of 81 degrees for your Mother's Day, but we do have that chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms. Some of them could be strong to severe. Winds coming in from the south southwest between 5 to 15 miles per hour with wind gusts up to 20 as well. It looks like a soggy week ahead. We have multiple chances for showers and thunderstorms lasting through Thursday. High of 73 degrees next Tuesday, 64 on Wednesday, 62 for a high on Thursday, and then the coolest day of the week next Friday with partly cloudy skies will at least be dry with a temperature of 61 degrees, and then next Saturday, partly cloudy, we climb back up into